See that? Mm. Sugar cookies. Sugar cookies. Fresh haircut. I think we're ready this weekend. But yeah, we made it to SIUE. To the hotel at least. Uh, we're gonna go work out here in 30 minutes, so I gotta pack my bag, and then, um, then we're just gonna relax for tonight. See you at the workout room. Is this, like, considered littering? Like, if you just, like, set, if, if you, like, set a can down on the ground, is that littering? Yeah, pretty sure. That's the way it's kind of littering. So, it's Joey. We are back from the workout. Um, I would say we're good on weight. Matthew's in there cutting his nails, but yeah, tomorrow we leave here at like 6:30 a.m. Weigh in at 8, wrestle at 10. So we got two hour weigh ins, which is fantastic. But yeah, the workout was. It was decent. It was decent today. It wasn't too bad. I've had better workouts than that, but. You know? We should have three, four, five matches, our coach says, tomorrow, so. Um. They're probably like 12 man brackets. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna head out tomorrow, early tomorrow morning, weigh in and then win. But right now we're just watching TV. And the, and the Michigan and Purdue game. Go Purdue! Ski ya! Set mine for 6 a.m. Yeah, I'll probably set mine for 6 a.m. as well. Depending on how how, how much I weigh, uh, the guys that need to work out leave at 6:30, and the guys that don't need to work out tomorrow morning leave at 6:50. So, hopefully, I'm the 6:50 group. Yeah. But it's about 7 o'clock right now, p.m. So we're just gonna relax for the rest of the night. I did some quizzes. Finals are coming up next week, so we gotta stay locked in. But, yeah, see you guys tomorrow.
We are right on way this morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is 6.04. And, uh, yeah, ready to go. Didn't sleep too well. Just tossing and turning. Um, but that's okay. Because we got through it. Um, you know, that's just what happens sometimes. You just can't sleep, and then, uh, I don't know. But you never remember anyway. You know, I just kind of coasted through the night. But I met with my parents last night. St. Nick brought me some candy and stuff. Delicious treats. Um, I'll indulge on these on the way back. But, yeah, those, those are going to be good. Got my drinks ready. Liquid IV. And uh, Crystal Light for more flavoring. Been weighing in uh, less than two hours, so. See you there. Oh, I didn't even record it. Uh, Here, we'll redo it. Uh, <laughs> Best fruit snacks in the game. Black Forest Juicy Burst, not a sponsor, but a delicious treat. Cool blue, possibly the best flavor. Surprised you didn't say um, cucumber, mm. weirdo. I said possibly the best flavor. <laughs> Cucumber's gross. Dude, no.
Hook it. Time. 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 Challenge the finals, right? Wait, I think time. Time What's up guys, it's Joey. We have made it back from Southern Illinois. Now it was a good tournament. Um, there were some low parts for sure, but all around I would say it was pretty good. So my first match, I messed up. I was up 5-1, coach told me to cut him. I cut him, he shot, I sprawled, arm was deep. He went for a dump, put me to my back, bro. Uh, it's really frustrating because, you know, I don't think I need to explain why that's frustrating. But I went on the backside, had to wrestle my teammate, unfortunately, right after that. <clears throat> I forgot to record that one, but I uh, won that match. It's a, It always sucks wrestling your own teammate, you know, it's just, we don't like that. Anyway, after that, I won another good. I won a good one um, against the SIUE guy. He's a tough wrestler. Uh, I was able to put him on his back early, which definitely helps. Um, I believe I beat him six four, maybe. He was pretty close too. That was a tough one. Um, and then my next one after that was against another Missouri guy. Put him to his back early with the cradle. I'm not a huge cradle guy, so like, I was locking it up and. I was squeezing so hard, and yeah, I was up 8-1 by the end of that, that uh, period, but whew, man, it's, it's, uh, you feel it if you squeeze that hard, you know, trying to pin someone. I ended up winning that one 8-5. You know, that match was good in the beginning, obviously, but I, I, uh, I was gassing out, I'm not gonna lie, I was gassing out. I just kept good, tried to keep good position, you know, I could, I should have been able to score more, and should have hit more attempts, but... We'll work on. We'll, we'll definitely be working on that in the room, you know, being relentless and whatnot. My last match, which was, which was the third place match, was um, it was a good match against a tough uh, guy from Northern Colorado. It was four four, uh, going into the last or I don't know. It was like ten seconds left, four to four. You know, um, I went for you know a little cradle. I don't know if we got. I got the footage, but I went for that cradle. Or I, I locked up a cradle. I, you know, it was it was an iffy. Like coaches tried challenging it, but the third place matches don't get challenges. Only the finals matches got challenges. So I didn't get a challenge. Uh, honestly, I don't think I got taken. I don't know. Uh, I would have to look back on it. But that was a tough match, tough loss. But nevertheless, we learned a lot, which is the most important thing. I had to get that stake in. You know, I haven't had stake in a while. Um, just had some, get that nice ribeye, juicy of course, basted with the garlic butter, uh, 
had some whipping cream and uh, sautéed mushrooms, blended that, blended that stuff up and uh, made a puree. Top that off. I love cooking. I really do. It's one of my hobbies. If you if you have if you if you know me, you know I love cooking. Um, obviously, that presentation wasn't crazy pretty or anything, but I was just there for the taste. That was immaculate. But this next week we got we got a week off again, um, and then the week after we have NDSU, North North Dakota State University coming home here, which is good. I don't want to go. Last year we went up there and it was so cold. So. I'm glad they're coming down here. If you're new here, comment down below, say hello, like, subscribe. If you want to know every time I post right away, hit that bell. I thank some of my teammates like Austin Keel, Jeremiah Reno, Matthew for recording my matches. It really helps out a lot, so thank you to those guys. Shout out. But as always, stay tuned, baby.